Hey guys, this is Aaron from Geeky Lemon Development and I have a nice short tutorial for you today and I'll be showing you how to hide the status bar in your application. So first things first, go to Xcode, File, New Project. Make sure it's a view based application for the iPhone and I'll name this status. So you that. Now hiding the status bar on your application gives you the illusion that you've built a well structured and more in depth app. Now if you've noticed already that some apps are already out at the moment, do you have the status bar still being shown at the top? Now this can make it look a little bit tacky and not very nice, so if you want to give your users the best visual experience possible, this is the best way to do it. Now there are two steps, the first step is going to all your views and setting the status bar to unspecified, that, that will make the um, status bar dis disappear at the top. And then the second step, you need to go into your P list and um, set it so the status bar is hidden throughout the whole application so it will not show up. So we start by step one and it's going to our view controller.nib. Now you will have to do this in well for each view individually. So if you have 20 views, it's gonna have you you have to do it 20 times for each one. It may take some time but in the end it will make your application a lot better. So if you just wait for the view controller to load up, should be done there. There we go. Now, at the moment here, the status bar is set to grey. You simply click that and to unspecified, and that should hide the status bar there. So that's done there for the view, and that's all that's needed. So we simply save that and quit. So nice and easy step one. So we go straight now to step two, into the P list. Now, at the P list here, click on the bottom line, and in the far right here, just add the plus sign, which will add an extra line. And then we're going to want to, well, we need to add the status bar is initially hidden. So we just search for that by scrolling down. Status bar is initially hidden. And make sure it's ticked. And then once you've done that, just simply save it. Now, all you, while ticking that there, you've um, told your application that you don't want the status bar to be shown in any of your views. And by doing step one, you've initially hidden the um, status bar. It won't show up at all. So that's all that's needed for hiding the status bar, so if you simply build and run, there will be no problems at all because we have put no code in it. Let's wait for it to load up. So all that should be shown in the simulator now is just the grey background as we've added no buttons or labels or anything like that, we haven't changed anything so it should just be a blank grey screen. And there we go, there's no status bar at all. Now building your application around that will make it a lot, lot better and more interesting for your users. So that's it for today then. Make sure you um, subscribe, rate, comment, do everything you can. And um, leave me a comment or send me a message if there's any tutorials you want to suggest. Also, I have a few applications already out in the App Store at the moment. There will be a link in the description for them. And also be a link in the description for my Facebook and Twitter. Make sure you follow and like them so you get more updates on, updates on the go and be the first to know but for now hope you enjoyed the video and hope it helps your projects and remember make sure you subscribe and I'll see you all next tutorial